In this tutorial, we will discuss creating pricing sheets with custom messages or coupons. Among its various features, Easy Controller is also capable of producing a pricing sheet along with printed orders. These pricing sheets can be customized to not only include pricing information, but also include marketing messages or coupons toward future purchases. Including a custom pricing sheet with each order can be a very effective method of direct marketing and is especially useful during the holiday season. A custom pricing sheet template can be created using the multi-purpose format creation software mode of Easy Controller. Once created, the custom pricing sheet can be added to various print channels for production. The multi-purpose format creation mode can be located by selecting the F function button on the main screen of Easy Controller, and then selecting the tool button. From the tool menu, select the multi-purpose format creation button. This will bring up a number of different choices for creating custom templates. Select the pricing sheet print format button from this menu. From this screen, you can create a new pricing sheet print or edit an existing one. For this demonstration, we will create a new pricing sheet print with a coupon. To create a custom pricing sheet print, select the New button. The first item to establish is the size of the pricing sheet print. For this demonstration, the width will be set for 152mm paper with an 89mm advance. The advance is set to 89mm as most prefer using the minimum advance for pricing sheets. We can also set a border around the pricing sheet if desired. The yellow box represents where the pricing information will be printed. Select the Next button to continue. You will notice that the yellow box is now pink. This indicates that it can be moved either by clicking and dragging or entering numbers in its X and Y positions. The next item to add will be the graphic. This can be added using the Add button. The box will turn red if these two items overlap one another. Click and drag the image box away from the pricing data box. Set the size of the image box to the desired size. For this demonstration, we will set this size to 80 mm by 80 mm. After resizing the image box, adjust its placement into the desired position. The image will now be added to the image box using the Image Data button and the Reference button. This is where you select a pre-designed graphic to be printed on the pricing sheet. This graphic should be sized to fit the open space of the image box and saved as a bitmap file. For this demonstration, we will use an 80mm by 80mm bitmap image. After being selected, the image will appear in the preview window. This graphic can be moved to the desired position on the pricing sheet by clicking and dragging or entering specific XY coordinates. Select the Next button to continue. We can now name this new pricing sheet template. For this demonstration, we will name it PhotoBook 2. Select the Complete button when done naming the template. With the new pricing sheet completed, the final step is to register the new template using the Register button. The new pricing sheet template is not accessible if not registered. Now that the template has been completed, we can exit this mode by selecting the Back button and then the End button. Now that a new pricing sheet template has been made, we can add it to a print channel for use. To enter the Print Channel setting menu, select the F button from the main screen of Easy Controller. From this list of items, select the Management Tool button. Then, select the Print Channel button. Select the desired print channel from this list of channels. Next, scroll to select the Pricing Sheet Setting tab. Using the Pricing Sheet Setting pull-down tab, select the new custom template. For this demonstration, the template is PhotoBook 2. After selecting the Pricing Sheet template, check the box next to Pricing Sheet Print Output Setting to enable its printing. 
You can also change the paper the pricing sheet will be printed on by selecting papers 1, 2, or 3. After verifying your selections for the pricing sheet print, select the OK button to exit this mode. Then select the back button to exit the print channel settings. If you are unfamiliar with setting the pricing, you will find the Easy Controller Help menu is very useful. You can search the Help Index for a topic such as pricing. Once you find the topic that you are looking for, you can bookmark it in the Favorites tab. You will find that adding a custom pricing sheet with a marketing message or coupon is an effective way to reach out to your customers.